Coming at you hot with another store pick. This time we have Heaven's Door Cask Strength or Single Barrel. It is a cask strength though. Yep. Single barrel cask strength. Is this gonna be good? I freaking hope so because it was a lot of money. <laughs> it was, it was like 60 bucks, wasn't it? It was like $55. Yeah, he can. So yeah, he it's can. actually not bad for a single barrel store pick. And okay, so it's Heaven's Door. This is coming to, you know, Mr. Bob Dylan, another uh, celebrity whiskey. We have, we've been a little, uh, I don't know, a little bit uh, wishy-washy on celebrity whiskeys. We found something that We've been that generous liked. here lately though. Like yeah. Tennessee and Noble were good. The first Heaven's Door we tried was, it was, eh, it was okay. Mm. Single barrel bourbon limited allocation is comprised of both our own distilled barrels and sourced from partner whiskey. Okay, I didn't realize that they were distilling their own. It's 75% corn, 21% rye, 4% barley, distilled in Indiana. Char number three, toast medium. And it's bottled at Heaven's Door Spirits in Minnesota. Memphis, Tennessee. <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs> this is bottle number 26. Congratulations. Crack it open. Sure. I need. Okay. All right. We're going to crack this open and I'm going to scratch the tube. Bourbon. Take them in. Is there a pull tab on this? Yes, there is. There a is a pull tab on this. <laughs> you got the knife out of your. And there's a pull tab. <laughs> it wasn't working either, clearly. All right, there we go. Pull. And only half the pull tab comes off. Come on, if you perforate these things, they should all come off. There we there go. We go. So it's going at 113.1 proof. Ooh, that's right in our sweet spot. Oh my God. There we go. That was that pretty good. Was pretty good. That was a son of a bitch to get off the. <laughs> get the obligatory towel out. Pop up the obligatory mess. <laughs> uh, if you saw the back of, there's more oh mess. My God, AJ. He must have ran down the side of the bottle and ended up as the brown stain on the mattress. <laughs> that smells pretty good. It smells like a bourbon. The first nosing I got of it was a little uh, oak astringent. A little what? Oak astringent. I don't know if I learned anything from that. Super oaky. I like say I, that. Like I just licked the. How about you talk to like people like they have a first grade oak, education? Like I just licked an oak tree with my you're, nose. You're just like you, you think you're talking to Harvard <laughs> graduates or something? <laughs> Probably an MIT guy in there or two. All right, I'm trying to put air into it. <laughs> All right, so the more air, yeah, the more <laughs> you had tacos, didn't yeah, you? Tacos, like, the more air it gets to it, like the creamier note um, is yeah. coming out, like a creme brulee, creamy egg custard, a little bit of nutmeg. Egg custard. Yeah, like a flan. Like <laughs> what? A flan. What is with you today? Like, we had Mexican for lunch. You didn't have Mexican for lunch. Flan is a egg custard Mexican dessert. I like how you come at me with thinking that I know that. How do you? How would you not know that? Because I'm not Gordon fucking Ramsay. <laughs> We just did Knob Creek 12 year. This smells better than Knob Creek 12 year. I this think. does. Okay, so just classic notes, brown sugar. Yeah. Heavy brown sugar. This smells super sweet. Yeah, super sweet. Like heavy brown sugar, baking spice. Jesus Christ. Oak, caramel. Like almost a medicinal cherry note kind of buried in there. Like Robitussin. All right, let's get let's get to it. That's nice. pretty good. The sweetness comes through on your lips. That's good. Mm. That's super sweet. The oak is coming through, like yeah. right up front the oak comes through. All of the taste for me hits up front and then it kind of dissipates on the back end. Mid palate goes a little flat, finish comes back strong with baking spice. Yeah. Like a black, in a black pepper note. That finish. Finish is good, yeah. It's a little spicy. That mid palate though, that, it's just, why does it disappear like that? I want it, I want it to stay, because it yeah. is good. Yeah, because it's like, oh, again. Super weird. I want to see what this is like once it opens up. Because I bet yeah, you it gets a little board. bit of air. That is going to open up some flavors. Maybe smooth out that oak up front. Yeah, because that oak's pretty strong up front. Yeah, it is. Well, everything's pretty strong up front for this one. Oh, it smells delicious. It smells good. It is good. I just... Yeah. I don't think that the, at least off the neck pour, and we'll come back around to this, off the neck pour, the taste doesn't match up to the nose. The nose is better. Question is, is it worth Picking up a single barrel. Now, every again, single barrels. Every every bottle is going to be different because every single barrel is going to be slightly different. Is it worth picking this up for like fifty-five ish? And this is a uh, barrel two seventy, bottle twenty six. Bottle doesn't matter, but the barrel does. The barrel twenty or uh, two seventy. If you find one of these, that's exactly what it's going to taste like. It might be different if you can find barrel four hundred. I'm going to reserve my absolute judgment. Yeah because of this being a neck pour. At the moment, I can't recommend spending that. For $55, 60 bucks, I would go pick up a Old Forster 1920. Or if I'm looking for a single barrel, I would pick up uh, I would pick up a Knob Creek single barrel. Similar price point, and I think much better. We'll revisit once we get past the neck pour here, let it get a little bit of air to it. This could be like Kennessy, where we didn't, we weren't real 
sure on Cassie yeah. up front. It came and back to it, it was delicious. To it. Oh, it was amazing once it got ear to it. Hey, by the way, if you like what we're doing, hit that like button and notification bell so you know when we're dropping new content every week. If you like seeing this and you want to see more, check us out on Patreon. Link will be in the description below. And it doesn't cost that much. It's just your soul yeah. and your all your kids.